Time now for baseball from the great state of Texas and Globe Life Park. Sonny Gray will be on the mound for the series opener. Eric, any thoughts? Yeah, Matty. In his last start, he gave his ball club six complete. Tried to hold back, but this is popped up, and he's retired one away. In the second spot, Jason Kipnis will stride in now. Play. Not only do you not want to lose this guy, but you got more trouble right there in the on deck circle. Oh, and he lets him off the hook there, as this isn't even close for high nineties. It makes those mid to low 90s guys look easy. But I'll tell you what, if he mixes his pitches well, it can still be plenty fast to have to deal with. And indeed, no look at second. He'll go straight to first and take the shoe out. Carlos Santana. He's set. Here comes the 1-1. Hard hit ball to second. Right to him. Throw in time, and the side is retired. Corey Kluber gets the call for game one of the series. What's your take on him, E.K.? Well, guys, he's having a real nice year. Averaging something has to give. Here's the payoff pitch. Ground ball sent back up the middle. Played on the backhand. And a good throw gets him one gone. Number 30 will make his way in now. Line to the right side. And that finds some outfield grass. It's a base hit. Oh, you talk about being comfortable at the plate. That's the way he's feeling it right now. Nine. He's running towards second. On the ground, softly towards second. Reined in. And indeed, he won't try to force it at second. He'll just flip on to first for the shoe route. Chris Davis. Got him swinging, and that will end the inning. On to the second inning now for Marlington with Jan Gomes will lead things. Line drive to center field, and a base hit here to open up the second. One rebate comes to the plate looking to flip. Swing and a miss, and down goes Uribe for round number one. Chris Young. Shot to third, but gloved by the third baseman for the out. Sam Fold will stand. To short. Andres fields it cleanly. On to second for the force out, and the side is retired. Adrian Beltre will stand in. Oh, here is Ian Desmond. And a slider. Oh, got a favorable call on that one as that's the first out of the inning. Ian Desmond readies for him. And this runs inside, and that looked like it got him pretty good. Number 19 will stand in. Well, Matt, the pitcher may have thought the runner might be on the move right there, so he slide steps to hang on to him. Hit in the air to shallow center. Davis comes on now and makes the catch in shallow center for round number two. Robinson Chirinos will stand in. Runners off for second. Hit swung on and missed the throw. Way late, and he's in there easily at second. I figured they weren't going to pitch out twice in a row, and he winds up taking second here and moving into scoring position. Fly ball out toward left center field. Davis will get there, and he puts it away to retire the side. Rajay Davis steps in here to start. Swing and a miss on the slider, and that's out number one. Francisco Lindor is in here. Hit in the air to right field. Chu moves over. Two down. Second base for number 22. So bases are empty here. And look out as that one ran in and got him. Mike Napoli stands in. He's old. 
On the ground to the left side. Backhanded. Throw to first in plenty of time, and the side is retired. We'll get a look at the speedy Elvis Andrus when... Here's Elvis Andrus. You have to figure that he's really going to need to keep the walks in check if he's going to have success here. I was thinking the same thing. No free rides. You've right. got to make... That's still not a bad take because you're facing a guy that's already walked a few guys, so make him throw some more pitches. Run that pitch count up. Oh, and it eats him up a bit. And now, oh, this ball's going to wind up out of play. And a big mistake there. Hit hard on the ground towards second. Only play will be to first as we'll see our first run score here as this is a 1-0 ball game. Grounded to short. Lindor scoops it up. Only play is going to be to first, so score it as an RBI ground out as the lead moves to 2 to nothing now. For commit to pitches like that down in the zone, I'd keep throwing him until he proves he can lay off. Bounced on the ground and right at the shifted infielders. And he'll step on the bag. Leading off the inning, Carlos... Swung on in the dirt for the third strike. Jan Gomes will dig in. And this one misses here. A close pitch on three and two, but Clyde Washington rules it ball four. One rebound. Play two and two. Oh, and there's the good curveball as he set down on strikes for the second time. Oh, he's he's got a legitimate gripe right there. I don't know about that one. A swinging bunt out in front of the plate. And he was thinking about third, but instead he'll throw to first. Oh, and that all developed too late to get him at first, and now the strike, it's nothing in one. Well, this guy has thrown a first pitch strike to about 50% of the batters he's faced. He's pitching well, but... Now he'll fake a throw to second and look to first instead. Throw to first, not in time, as the run is across to score. The batter, center. Drilled right back up the middle. He gets dirty, but he can't get there, and it's into center field. One run is scored. Ah, oh, but the throw is well up the line, and a second run's going to score. Francisco Lindor will stand in now with three home. All comes from falling behind hitters and then having to come in there with something good to hit. That's going to get you every time. Fielded by Beltran. Throw to first is in time, but meanwhile, the runner is in to score. Stepping in, Jason Kipnis. Strike three, and that'll put an end to a big inning. Adrian Beltre will stand. Chopped weakly to the left. Arebe bare hands it. He's out. Oh, love it. Ian Desmond. Slapped hard the opposite way. And he will make the play out there, and there are two away now. Well, it's still early, but it's also worth noting that he'd be in line for the win if this... Left side. Rebay's got it. Throw on to first, gets him, and the side is retired. One, two, three, go the Rangers. They trail it here, four to two. Mike Napoli come in now to lead things off against our just fine up until the last time he took the mound he's got to hope that that was just an aberration or he might not stick around to see another in Moreland in foul ground a quick out number one up next for three Carlos Santana will stand in goes the other way and this is in the air out to left and that'll get down for what should be extra bases Santana will take the turn and head for second now. And he's in there safely. He's got a double. Now batting. Jan Gomes. He's set. Here's the 0-1. Tapped out in front of home. On to Moreland, and that's in time for the second out. One rebound will stand in now. A punch out. A mind game, and you'll start falling into some pretty bad habits. Throws him for strike three, and that retires the side. 
One left for the Tribe, but they... Leading off the inning, Robinson... That's a strikeout pitch there on 0-2. It's one he loves going to, but great recognition there at the plate to lay off. Throw, got him, and that's a gorgeous play. The shortstop, number one. So one gone in the inning now, and here's the short... Swing and a ball line hard towards short, but right at the shortstop for the second out. All right, fielder number 17. Shinsu Chu. Shot toward right center. That gets down, and he's got himself a base hit. Now batter. Number 30. Number 30. Ripped on the ground to first. And he'll step on the bag himself, and the inning is... Chris Young makes his way to the box to lead. Bouncer down the line. Beltre's there. Throw to first gets him, so the leadoff man's retired here to begin the sixth. And here's a look now at his pitches by inning so far. And you can see he had tied in a full count, three and two. Hit hard on the ground to third. Beltre has it. Throw gets him. Two down. How about it? The center fielder. Rajay Davis. Well, that rough inning a couple innings back. He put up a zero last time, and he's close to doing it again. Now a swing and a ball hit in the air down the left field line. And that'll get down for a base hit. And he'll make it in there with a two-out double. Francisco Lindor. Yeah, that's the put-away curveball. A great pitch with two strikes. You start it in the zone and then let it work out and see if he'll chase. Yeah. And nothing will come of the two-out double. Mitch Moreland will come forward now to start out their half of the... all game. Bat explodes as this has popped up. And he'll steer clear of the flying debris to make the catch here for the first down. Chris Davis... Lifted the other way out to left center. Fulb is camped under this one. And yeah, that's out number two. The third baseman. Adrian Beltre come in now with two away. And smoked on the ground left side. And that's through for a hit. Next Ian race. Desmond digs in. There. Swing, line, drive. That's going to be trouble. So now they'll have two men in scoring position following the two out double. Now Number, 19 Number 19 comes forward trying. Got him swinging in the dirt. Gomes has it throw to first and that gets him out of the jam Sean Tollison is on the pitch now as he'll take over to start inning number seven now to the plate Jason. the inning it's one and oh you know some of Jason Kipnis teammates affectionately call him dirt bag because he has a habit of giving his body up and getting his uniform dirty on every play you gotta love a guy like that and the seventh inning starts with a fly out here one away Three and two. He knows the drill out there. You got to make him swing the bat. To not be giving up walks at this stage of the game. Because those could be fatal. Ground ball right side. Straight into the shift. Oh, and he has some trouble with it. And a good effort as he's able to stick with it. Robinson Chirinos. Will try. I'm not sure he's throwing a bad slider tonight. Every one of them has had a ton of movement. Lifted in the air out towards left center. Davis is in retreat as he pulls it in for the first out. The shortstop, number one. Elvis Andrews. He can throw a lot of pitches. He probably doesn't have a whole lot That's left wrong. in the tank, so the more you make him work, the better your chances of getting a mistake. Shinsu Chu. A pause and the 0-2. Andrus is moving. 
swing and a hot shot towards the hole. And that's in for his second hit of the afternoon. And they'll have runners at the corners following the one-out single. The batter. Here comes the Indians manager to make that slow trip to the mound. And it looks as though that's going to be all for his starter here tonight. Number 30. Will stop leaning out over the plate. Well, the pitcher's got to be able to work inside, so that's just a reminder. And he will deliver one of the biggest at-bats of the night. It's a base hit. Scoring is the runner from third, and that'll cut the lead down to one. Mitch Moreland. Long if you make a habit of working up there with your secondary pitches. And here's a swing and a miss. And that, folks, is a big out number two. So Strat, they've had him out of whack all game long. Now here's a line drive, and this may turn things around. It's down for extra bases. And the tying run comes around to score from second. But it is not in time as they take the lead here in the late going. And he is in there. So a runner at third. Oh, now a ball hit up the middle, and it's going to get on through into center field for a base hit. Coming in to score is the runner from third, and they've pushed it to two here in the seventh. Brian Shaw will get the ball looking to get the final out now here in this seventh inning. Ian Desmond steps in. Hit the other way out toward right field. Young is there. No trouble with this one, and the inning is over. Keone Kella will be summoned from the now bullpen now, as he'll take here. over to start inning number, number eight. Keone Kella leading off the inning. It's in the dirt that time, and it's back to even now at two and two. Aye. And a check swing here, but the bat clearly breaks the plane as he's set down for the first out. Hard hit toward the hole. And just past his outstretched glove into left, the base hit. Michael Brantley will come on to pinch hit here. So with a lefty waiting, they'll go to a lefty of their own. The 0-2 pitch. Slider strike three called, and that's a pitcher's pitch right there. Two gone. Marlon Bird will come on to pinch. This is line to left. A screaming base hit here, his first of the night. Rajay Davis steps in for Sam Dyson. Will come on now in a safe situation, but he'll be asked to get four out. Just the same pitch three times in a row. I guess he figures, why mess? And we'll have to leave it there as this is strike three, and that will... Michael Brantley will stick around as he'll take over in right field. Marlon Byrd will stay in the ballgame now and take over in left field. Lazy fly ball out to center field. Davis is under this one. And he puts it away for the first down. Now batting. Robinson Chirinos. Drilled on the ground is short. He's got it. Throw on to first, two gone. A short stop, number Elvis one. Andrews Elvis. digs in. Drilled to the left side. Oh, what a dive. The throw. Safe. Oh, man, that would have been awesome. Right. That was a big time stab. There was just two. Here's the 1 1. And here's a pitch inside, and that got him. I think things are getting a little frosty down there now. Standing in now, number 30. We're starting to spiral here, and you've got to make sure this doesn't spin completely out of control. Bat explodes as this has popped up. And he'll reach first safely. A play at the plate. And the runner is out at the plate as they cut him down trying to score. Rangers leave a pair. The Margaret Hunt Hill Bridge with Dallas in the background as we welcome you back to baseball on the show. Francisco Lindor will stand in to lead things off. 
Here he comes on a ball and two strikes. Up the middle and off his leg. And good hustle to get over and tag him for the out. Second baseman here. Jason Kipnis. Will tough pitch to lay off there with two strikes. I'm not sure if that was a good take or whether he just got fooled on a changeup and couldn't pull the trigger. Two down here in the ninth. Mike Napoli makes his way to the field. A walk here would be a huge development in this game with two outs in the ninth inning. You don't want to bring that tying run to the plate. Throw will be in time to get him at first base, and the Rangers have taken the opener here at home as this ball game is over. Well, I think this guy got pressed into duty in the eighth inning, but he gets the job done, and he goes out to earn himself a four-out save. Before we take our leave, time for a look at our final line score here in what turned out to be a... Take a good look. You won't see it for long. Six consecutive games with a home run. And the Rockies are right back in it. Donaldson had a walk-off home run April 18th against Atlanta in the 10th. A three-run walk-off home run May 26th against the White Sox in the 9th. hit it to the right place and he hits it out to center right center Blackman's got a long way to go he's still Bounce going the wall. and it is go, off the go. wall it takes a funny hop Kemp is rounding second go. he's heading to third go. and Matt Kemp into third base with a triple and the first cycle in the history of the San Diego Padres and the pitch breaking ball lifted in the air to center field Kiermaier going back to the track at the wall jumps up and did he get it Yes, he did! Oh, my! Here's the 1-1. High, towering fly ball left field. Cespedes has lost it initially. Rajay on the run as well. Davis leaping! Rajay with a catch! Oh, ho What a play by Rajay Davis. He took a two-run homer away from David Ross. How are you liking this? McCutcheon hammers it deep left field. Way back it goes, Upton to the track, to the wall. He leaps, and Upton stole a home run. That ball was at least a row deep, and Upton committed.